The town of Paradise is calling for changes to be made in order to have a safer evacuation process. Action News Now reporter Danny Maston spoke to people in Paradise today and shows us now what they're trying to accomplish. The whole controversy is over power lines just like these. The town of Paradise wants power lines to be put underground in order to mitigate poles catching on fire and falling into roadways. Before the campfire, um, all of the utilities were above ground on poles. Uh, that did create issues during the evacuation because the poles got on fire, they ca came across the street, they blocked um, the ability for people to, to evacuate in, in their cars. Paradise Town Manager Kevin Phillips tells me that PG&E has agreed to put power lines underground, but is also trying to partner with AT&T and Comcast to get telecommunication infrastructure underground. But AT&T and Comcast are currently not on board. There has not been the cooperation with uh, AT&T and with Comcast that we were hoping for. What we're trying to do is create a Basically, it's called the Rule 28 district um, that uh, would require them to be underground, and that's in, under our municipal code, requires them to go underground in certain areas, which are certain high traffic areas. It's brilliant because Paradise has already gone through a major fire, and we don't want to continue to have the higher risk. By the way, I did reach out to AT&T and Comcast, and so far have not heard back. In Paradise, I'm Danny Mastin, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. A uh, public hearing will take place October 13th at 6 p.m. at the Paradise Town Hall.